does work. Hi everybody, welcome to Gunpoint. Did you just get thrown out of a plate glass window? No. I work at the gun company across the road. Someone had just got thrown out of your apartment window. I don't want to talk about that. I was actually about to call you about something else, but now I'm more interested in this. I, uh, you know, understandably. Try to move on. What did you need? My name's Selena Delgado. My boss, Rook, says you're some kind of freelance spy. You know, those are just networked around. Oh my god! Hello! Snapper IV! Just subscribed. Yay! Love you. Thank you, thank you. You want to come up? To my laboratory. Thank you very, very much. Guys, welcome out to the show again. I think I'm actually beginning the game here. I'm, I, uh, I'm starting in a kind of an awkward position because Gunpoint doesn't really have like a menu screen or anything like that. Or, Well, yeah, th this is it. Kind of jump into it and then, uh, and then this happens. So there's that. <laughs> oh, Jen, yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't have the uh, the screen set up proper to uh, to show you the love, but know that I do appreciate your continued support. All of you guys, and welcome out to the show. This is, of course, the Bear Taffy Live Show. Goes down every Tuesday and Thursday at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, as well as Saturdays at 2 p.m. Playing for the first hour for the foreseeable future, Gunpoint. And uh, someone mentioned it. I'm sorry if I uh, yeah, Lone Soul. You said I was. I did say I was going to try out some Starbound uh, after Mark of the Ninja, and I'm still maybe in the mood for giving that a whirl. But I played it a little bit myself, and uh, I wasn't really feeling it. I don't know if it's just not my thing. I imagine that's probably the case. Oh, sorry guys, I'm totally skipping over this stuff. I'm a dummy. These are his uh, bullfrog trousers that he just picked up. Give him a whirl. As one would when they just bought new pants. This is Gunpoint, of course. Everything basically by Tom Francis. Some additional stuff by these few folks you've seen up on screen. And it just throws you right into the thick of it. Which I really like. Conway, this is Melanie Rook. Selena Delgado worked for me. Do you have time to talk? I didn't kill her! I know. I just watched the footage. You walked right in front of a security camera on your way to Selena's office after the shots were fired. But the East Point police won't look beyond an easy conviction. That footage puts you at the scene and I have to turn it over to them. I agree that I am boned. to hand the footage over if I have it. Let's make sure I don't have it. I've wiped my copy, but my camera feeds get backed up to data centers in five different off-site locations. If you can wipe them all, you're on the clay, and your police will have to find the real killer. That actually sounds fairly wise. Fairly is my pet peeve word, man. Such a filler. Head to the data sec facility at Port Health and make sure the front door is open, but you have to take it from there! So this is our mission screen. It's a handheld phone, and it uh, resembles no particular model of phones that you might be interested in. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, no, I'm not. I'm gonna bring that back for Seymour. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, the footage of you at the murder scene has been automatically backed up to five different locations. This one is the closest. You need to get in there and wipe that data. Why? She's from Australia, New Zealand. She has red hair. Obviously, has to be from that place. Top floor of this building, there's a bank of servers with a computer nearby. If you can get to that, we can wipe the evidence that you were at the offices when Selena was killed. Got it. No further clarification needed. So these are the introductory levels. I've played a couple of them. I haven't really gotten that far myself. But, uh... Wouldn't that made her Scottish or <laughs> Probably. <laughs> when you're labeling people based on their hair color, you don't really care that much for specifics, apparently. Uh, Rostin da Dostin, you're just in time to see some gunpoint, my friend. Glad you can make it out. Yeah, not... No, it's, it's a Scottish thing, probably. Okay. So, yeah, it's uh, basically teaching you the gist of things. Uh, you can probably already tell our movement is pretty simple. We just got the WSAD keys. We also got 
a space bar that can occasionally interact with things. Uh, the W key actually more often than not is what you want to press when you're looking to interact with computers and switches and all that kind of nonsense. And then you charge up your jump like so. You can climb down most of these walls here, actually hang on to this ledge as well, which is going to probably come in handy in a little bit. For now it's time to head up this elevator. You have a feeling Bear will die in this series. I, uh, I don't doubt you. Well, that would mean I doubt me, so maybe I do. I've heard grumbling lately from some officers about your private security assignments since we merged with the city's largest security firm. The East Point Police Department now serves both roles. You might not like working for a corporation, but your job is the same. Protect and serve. With the endless budget cuts we've been through, the new funding from this merger is the only reason you even have halfway adequate equipment. Basically, suck it up, you pansy. Let's get up here. There's little mini computer devices like that, so it's, uh... You know, I'm starting to notice a pattern between the... Between the games that I've selected in the, in the past few series here in the Bear Taffy Live show of... Of being a... Stealthy ninja cat. And, uh... Clearly... Clearly I'm suited for it. Although obviously not at the same time. Get your grades at the end here. Uh, took quite a bit of time. An empty bar is the fastest time thought possible. A full bar is double that. So this isn't actually just like a progression of seconds or something. This is based on the mission you're playing. And if you get like all the way down to here, it is possible to have an empty bar, which you would think would represent zero seconds, but it's actually represented representation of how quickly it can be humanly done. Uh, noise pretty self-explanatory. Same with violence and witnesses and all that stuff. The client rates you based on how well you fulfilled optional objectives. Get some money, get some upgrade points, and we're good to go. Good job. Uh, not particularly, but all right. I don't think they actually react that much to uh, to, <laughs> to what I choose to say. So I, I I'm leaning toward just being incredibly rude. I'm a gentleman ghost ninja. I would certainly hope so. Queens are backed up at four more facilities. The others are slightly better guarded, but nothing too taxing. Give you the addresses in order of security, since frankly, I have no idea how good you are. Thanks for giving my personal crisis a difficulty curve. You dick. See a mission briefing for a job on Brad Moore Drive. Take it. Do what I can. To help you, Shani. The Westfield facility has better security. My guy to come over to the front door for you, but the door to the security server room is locked. Two guys working tonight. Whoever's in the server room could probably open the door to it, so get him to do it for you. Isn't that kind of the opposite of a guard's job description? A good guard would be guarding. These guys spend more time dealing with electrical faults than professional spies. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she made fun of you directly. She disrespected your workforce. Press star mission. <laughs> I gotta read stuff. Obviously. Hello, Doxy can barely read the text. See, that's why I gotta read it out loud. People can't see it, damn selves. Guards will shoot on sight. The cursor turns red in areas guards can see. Jump on a guard to pin him to the ground like that! And then you punch the bejesus out of him! As much as you want! Just as much... violence... as you can muster! Then you get off. <laughs> that's, that's the mission! Oh, no, nah, we gotta go. We gotta go check out the, uh, the computer down here. This is where things are going to start to be a little bit more interesting, and they're going to get a lot more interesting in a little bit here. Only guards can use the red hand scanners, which we're looking at right here. This is a shut door, so he can actually see me right now, otherwise he'd shoot me right in the goddamn face. Uh, in the dark, guards will look for a light switch. Guards cannot see very far in the dark, which means we need to go like that. Jump back onto this wall here. See if we can hack the computer real quick. Get back up. And they can see pretty damn far. They're not like the Mark of the Ninja guards. They're at least semi-aware of their surroundings. Punch them a little bit more. Or teabag them. <laughs> or the equivalent of. And there we go. Easy enough, right? Another A+. Plus. I thought, uh, how did I not get maximum violence? I beat the crap out of that guy. Jeez, that was all I was going for. All right, we've got $85 and some upgrades available. To get into the Ellis Street facility, you need to rewire the building's electronics. If you don't have a cross link, buy one! She's a demanding woman. There it is. Oh, man. Look how exciting some of these are here. We get a 
The handgun is like the last upgrade you buy, which is kind of indicative of what the entire game is like. Oh, you can kick down doors, dude. Jeez, that's crazy. Land silently from any height, rewire enemy guns, all kinds of fun stuff, hopefully coming up in the near future here, but for now we're going to go ahead and buy the crosslink, which allows us to rewire electronic devices, which is probably why a lot of people know about this game, because it's the big uh, main mechanic to it. Uh, we can also build up our bullfrog jump strength, which sounds like a good idea to me. Uh, maybe I should do it, charge it up more quickly, just one point into there. Okay. Gun, call of stealth, gun pointy thing bear. I wish my name was after a colon at some point in my life. Then I'll know I've made it. Only when your name secedes. Secedes. <laughs> Only when your name separates itself legally and forms its own country do you know you've truly made it on the internet. I can't open the server room door on it, it's straight in there, no god's working or not, you have to do it yourself. How do I do that? Might. Might. Any building wide in the last 20 years puts everything on a single power grid. The way things are connected is all handled in software, and software can be hot. You got cross link, you can see all the connections and drag them around to work however you want and make a light switch, open the door, whatever! See, it's after a coin, you know it's official. What actually is a cross link? I'm actually curious about that. Just a mod for your phone lets you hack stuff. Some security geek. It's just a thing for asshole kids. <laughs> just mess with people. Her accent seems to have changed drastically in the past 10 minutes. <laughs> got it. Oh, she's got it. That always confuses me. She just straight up leaves. No one says goodbye anymore, man. Switch to cross-link mode with a mouse wheel. Click and drag a line from any device to link it to any other. If you linked from the switch to the door, the switch can open the door. Whoa! Direction matters. Linking them the other way around won't do anything. So we can do that. Make the light switch go to the light. We can drag the light to the light switch, which, as it just mentioned to us, does literally nothing. Or we can do it like that. Make it do what I want it to do. As is customary. We can also link it to this door, which means once we get up there, we'll be able to open the door with the light switch and get inside this room, which is probably what we need to do. So let's have a quick look. First of all, we need to use this staircase. Flip the switch, and that was easy enough. What a simple tutorial level. Come on, man. Challenge me. I'm ready. Goodbyes are sad. That's true. The guide to keeping characters' accents the same over time. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's completely impossible. Cannot be done. At the end of this, she'll just be like... A, a warbled mess of speech. It's gonna be really disappointing, I'm sure. The next terminal is on Luxley Close. By the way, be careful with power sockets. They'll emit a shock if you cross-link something to them. Ooh, scary. We have one more upgrade point here. I think it might be time for another bullfrog jump strength increase. And I don't think I have enough to buy anything else here, so let's go ahead and jump right into the next mission. Warble garble. This game looks good. This game is good. I've heard very, very good things about it, but I haven't played a lot of it myself, and I'm excited to. Now, let's see. Computer up there. We've got our light switch going to a light, which obviously isn't going to help us out. Uh, man. Lots of options here. I'm going to go ahead and jump over to the roof, because that makes me feel more comfortable. So if we go in here, he's going to see me right away, so I might just want to... You know I can just take this guy out. It's probably not a terrible idea. Oh, wait a minute. No. Oh, whoops. <laughs> there we go. Take him down real quick. Now I can, um, I can adjust this switch. So it... Oh, wait, no. I'm, I'm jumping. I'm a silly guy. I can adjust this switch so it uh, turns out this light, and at that point I can go up here and I can... Ooh, I have many options. I like this one though, let's go ahead and do that. I'm gonna turn this off. Jump right past this guy. Go like so. Wait for him to come back around. And then go... Beautiful. Of course, I'm sure there's alternatives, much like Mark of the Ninja, where we get through all these things without being detected in any way, shape, or form. 
It's also a lot of fun to punch people. As we are all well aware. Let's go ahead and sync those two up. And we're out of here. Baller. Non-lethal, at least. And a ninja. Very good. Last one in your clear, the data check place on Gershwin and Forth is the biggest and most heavily guarded. But after this, there'll be no evidence leaking you to Selena's murder. Her voice is just changing consistently. Hello, Blue Fire. There, we need you to do a playthrough of a game where you just go wobble gobble randomly. I felt like I've been doing that already. That's that's my life. He's just saying wobble gobble. Need a three different tournaments to knock each one. Are you seeing anyone about your backup addiction? You never know when a suspected murderer is going to try to systematically erasing them. You do if you hired him. Oh, snap! Plot twist. <laughs> okay. This looks interesting. It's almost like she's becoming a bear. She'll just growl at me one day, and that'll be frightening. Okay. There are three different terminals I all... Or rather, all of them need to be hacked at the same time. And he can see right there. I just realized now they have fields of view that are kind of visible. Hello, Kirk. And Caboose? Can you turn off the cameras? Good question. I imagine so. Oh yeah, you can totally do that. Well, he's gonna see me if I show up over here, so let's see what kind of light switch options I have. Hmm. First of all, we obviously don't want to just jump right up here, because this guy's gonna shoot me in the face. Let's go ahead and jump up there. This looks like a safe place to be. He's not looking at me. I could jump right through the window and take him down, but it's not really necessary. You know, what I could do is, uh, switch this light, standing right here. That turns off that light, which would force this man out over here. That could do it for me. Hello, William. If you walk in that camera, does it start another five mission story? I would imagine so. Now, we've got three or four different light switches. I don't think this guy is going to matter. I suppose I might as well take him out. I'll take him out. There we go. Uh-oh. Oh, he was alerted by that. Well, that makes sense. I suppose when I think about it, <laughs> that's a perfectly valid thing to have happen. Now we can go up here. We can take this guy out like so. Yeah, there we go. Taking the dudes out, I don't feel that, that bad doing so. Just a matter of making sure that I... optimize my... opportunities to... get by when I do so. Now we can rewire this and we can turn off this light with that. Not sure how helpful that's gonna be, but I'll... have a look, see if I can... Alter this guy's course in any way. He's gonna open that door, maybe? Or I could open that door myself. Or I could switch over to the proper thing. Here we go. Aha! There we are. Maybe I should have done that in the first place. That was probably for the best. Let's see. Oh, I can lock him out! Ooh, that's a fun idea. That's a really good idea. I'm gonna go ahead and go like this. Wait for him to bounce back. Oh, yes! That's awesome! I'm gonna go right downstairs. I'm surprised he didn't notice that the elevator was called, although I'm sure he wouldn't really be so suspicious about that. Guards can't see me when I'm hitting the elevator. Nice. Ooh, that is a, uh, that is a fun method of taking care of this guy right here. Now I've got another light switch. I don't think I even need to worry about this guy. If I just go down here... Whoops! Oh! <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I didn't realize... He oh, that's right. He's gonna notice the elevator went off. Okay. Well, that's an issue. Hmm. Well, here's the plan. We can go back up. Rewire this light switch to turn off this light here. Do that. 
Get in. Go down really fast. Oh. Oh, yeah. There we go. Now he's not going to be able to turn the light back on. Beautiful. That was entirely planned. From the get-go, I, <laughs> I guarantee it. Okay, now is there anything else I need? I bet I could just... Oh, hey, we, get, we got another hack here. Cameras don't hate black people. <laughs> need to put to rest this idiotic rumor about our security software detecting dark-skinned people as intruders. Uh, that means if anyone who isn't police or private security walks in front of a camera, regardless of skin color, it will trigger... <laughs> That is great. Okay, good to know. Now, how am I getting out of here? I could go through the window, but I think I'd rather avoid that. Instead, what I'm going to do, I think, is set this to take out this door. Switch it off. I'm glad that that op Oh, God. <laughs> that strategy didn't work. That's a well-lit area. Probably should have been aware of that. You guys probably noticed it too. I like the uh, I like the saving functionality of this game. Gives you uh, several different opportunities to reload your progress if you f up sufficiently enough. There's an easy way to get out of things. Yep. Did he just shoot me? Oh my god! He saw me from that far away. Uh. Wow. Okay. So. Here's a good example of when you want to use a different autosave, because that one totally bones us. So perhaps what I... Oh, whoops. Oh, damn it. Maybe now I'm not going to be able to get past this. He is an elite guard. He knows what he's doing. All right, so it looks like my best option here is going to be to let this guy back inside. So let's go ahead and do that. Use my other switch here. Yep. Rewire the console. Oh wait, it's already actually going to that doorway. So here we go. Let him back in. Switch it off again. And now I want to avoid breaking the window because I feel like I might get a little bonus by being a little quieter. Which is probably silly of me to think. And I'm already going to do it anyway, so whatever. Here we go. Beautiful! We did it. I was thoughtful yet again. I got the laptop at least. It's still an A-plus ranking, so I, I win. I win, overall. I'm glad Bear is just as good a spy as he is a ninja. You know, anything regarding being sneaky is Bear's proficiency, as we've all been confirmed <laughs> in our own minds over and over again. I think that concludes our business. There's nothing left that links you to Selena's murder. So the East Point police are going to have to look a little harder. If you know what I mean. Then what? Exactly where he is. I have a medical degree in a gun company. He's gonna find out why that makes it a bad idea to kill someone I like. That is fairly ambiguous. Hi, sorry to bother you guys. I don't know if this is the right place to post this, but I've just been arrested for murder, and I don't really know anyone, so I used my one call to post this. <laughs> Hope you can help. Katie. Oh, Katie. Classic Katie. What is going on with Katie? I suppose I could buy myself a wire jack and go check out what's available there. Yeah, boost up my jump strength as well. Let's see what Katie needs. This this looks like this looks like a YouTube comment interjected into my. Uh, <laughs> this is like the quintessential example of hi. Sorry to bother you guys. I I want you to check out my channel. And, uh, I don't know anyone, so I'm also in jail, please. I need five views, or they'll give me the death chair. The death chair, the electric chair. Do they call it the death chair? That's the, that's the, uh, colloquial phrase for it, I'm, I'm sure. Let's go ahead and do this. Thanks so much for replying! What's the situation? <laughs> for this money, even lowercase eyes couldn't keep me away. Sorry, my typing's not great. This is this is California girl Katie Collins right here, right? I brought this phone from a sex worker, and I haven't figured out how to do the capitals on it yet. My name's Katie Collins. I work at Rook, the gun company, and my friend Selena was killed last night. Someone's saying they saw me there. All the footage has been deleted. 
Oh shit! I know! Wasn't there at all last night, but I live alone, so I can't prove it without the footage. What can I do? I mean, oh, what can I do? <laughs> That's not her. <laughs> oh. Person they say saw me there is a Melanie Rook's husband, Jackson. Jackson! I'm sorry. I'm really sorry about this voice. <laughs> Maybe you can stop by his building and just see what's going on. Get him in trouble. I'd want to get him in acid. Ha 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 ha. That's where the laugh track cues in. Yes, we should be forgiving of everyone involved in this. Uh, let's go with the generic one here. Does your wife ever wonder about you a little bit uh, almost every day? No apostrophe. Hell probably be in his office. <laughs> She's saying that with attitude. Hell probably be in his office. On the top floor. If you can get close enough to hear what he's saying, maybe you could listen in for a clue or something. And then throw him in some acid. Please, no acid! I told you not to use acid, oh my god! I already said that. Oh my god, use spaces! Use punctuation and capitalize! Jesus! <laughs> Hello, everybody. Thanks for coming to the Bear Taffy Live Show. Okay, we have a new device! Use the mouse to pan in crosslink mode. Hmm. I guess I uh, I only have the crosslink mode available here. Let's go ahead and have a look if I can jump right there. This will activate nothing. But these do. This door will open when a motion detector is activated. Interesting. Which I imagine is down here. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Could be. Obviously not going through the front door, which means, uh, oh, that'll work. Okay. So what do we need to do here? Your name is spelt wrong, doesn't contain a space, and has two capital letters. Why the heck are you complaining? <laughs> you got me. You got me. Now, uh, alt? Oh, I see what I'm doing here. Okay. Wait a minute. No, I don't. Camera to door. Oh, got it. Got it. Wait, no, I don't want to do it that way. I want to do it this way. Yes! Okay, that was silly of me. Let's get to it now. I I am the, uh... I'm the always avoid cameras no matter what the cost kind of mindset, so... Do forgive me. Get to the green circuit box and use it. You'll be able to rewire things on the green circuit. Nice. Use that. Okay, now we have many more options on our wire jack, so let's see if we can get upstairs. The elevator will take me right up here. There's a dude. Oh, he's he's just chilling. Hmm. Party time, Austin. Hey there, buddy. Just partying. You know how we be. Now let's check the green circuit here. I think I want to turn this from here. To there. Right? No, I wanna I wanna make it this thing. And then I wanna switch this to that. No, that's not gonna let me do that. But if I don't change it to something else, that'll just go off. Oh wait a minute. This door's not gonna work. Hmm. A curious position we've put ourselves in, unless I were able to change this to here. No, I'm not able to do that. They're on different wires, it would seem. So the easiest option here is just to open this. At which point I can then switch this over to this. Or do I even need to do that? Perhaps not. Let's leave that on that link for now. I can switch that off and on, but I obviously want to leave it open for now. Okay, Caleb, we're playing some gunpoint, my friend. Trigger when anyone goes through. Oh, I see. So this is just something we can walk through, and it's not necessarily anything we need to worry about. Uh-huh. You asked me to watch Intex's purchase strategy, and I have. I'm confused. They're buying the same set of materials we were last week in crazy amounts, and I still don't see how they could ever be used in any legal firearm. Ooh. 
Shut up and uh, stop asking stupid questions, Katie. Yeah, Katie's not too terrible at writing emails, apparently, but her texting could definitely use some work. Okay. So this motion detector here... It's set off when we, uh, pass by, but it doesn't really matter, because we can just call this thing down. Need to get in here and talk to this guy. Oh, I see. We're just listening to the phone call. Nice. Space... Oh, gotta continue. I'm a genius. The game is called Gunpoint, y'all. It's a real good time. Well, thank you, Captain Hindsight. I didn't know they were bugging me. Yeah. This, this guy is obviously super sarcastic, so that's gonna be his bug... He's, that's his voice the whole time. You can't hear a bug. It's not the 90s. <laughs> yeah, alright. I'll let you know. Sorry for the inconvenience. Now I'm crying. Oh no. I'm so sad. Let's get in and go down the elevator. Hi, Bisnap. How's it going, buddy? Uh, I'm gonna... Ooh. I'm gonna open this doorway. I guess I can just... Leave. I kinda wanna go in there and talk to him. He looks like he could use a hug or a punch or some of both. I could just go. Dive into the subway! That was beautiful. I got an extra eight dollars! Or I had an extra eight dollars. Something like that. Oh, pretty damn well, I think. Okay. What happened? Do you hear anything? A company called Intex have an incriminating record of him. Recording. Rap, rap record. They have an incriminating debut album. They're our main rivals, a big multinational company who just opened an office here in East Point. Any idea why they'd be recording Jackson's phone calls and making him super sarcastic like? Any idea at all? Jackson runs his own company, but it's a dummy company for rock. Intex would definitely want to hear its calls. Why would he say terrible things, though? Oh god, I don't want to think of it. He's trying to frame me, maybe he's involved. Oh, he's a murderer. He's a murderer! Oh, you think? <laughs> That's... That is rude. For dealing with... A woman who is just arrested and thinks her husband might be a murderer. This is really messed up. But thanks for doing this, I think it's going to be a huge help. Oh, it's sad. Oh god, I need her to text more professionally. Disgusting pay. <laughs> oh, why would people describe things in these ways? Ooh, let's see. First of all, drop shot. God, I love the jazz in the menu screen, man. That's good stuff. Is this too quiet? I want it to be louder. I want the loud jazz. That's the best kind. Right in your grill kind of jazz. Let's get another jump strength upgrade. I'm thinking drop shot, although a muffle of breaking glass could be good as well. Let's get the drop shot for now. And then return it. Oh, psych out! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, I'm, I'm interested in the industrial esp espionage here. Let's go ahead and roll with this for now. Who are- Hey, man! Back at ya! Jessler, CEO Intex. I need someone serious. Are you? I'm serious enough to respond with your same question right back at you in our first conversation. But, no, not really. Whatever. <laughs> it does- It literally doesn't matter. You could say anything at that point. Where is it? What am I stealing? Rook makes guns, she's working on some bullshit secret project she thinks is gonna let her get around the gun ban, and she doesn't think I know about it. I'm not wild about stealing from Rook. Cry, I don't care if it's his business, you can get it done, and let's blah blah blah. This guy is pretty much like Peter Parker's boss in Spider-Man. In video game form. Almost unquestionably. Cool cats, welcome to the... <laughs> oh, I need to host a show called that. Welcome to Cool Al Jazz with Bear Taffy. Where is it? 
We're just going to find out where it is. She's outsourcing all the work the company called TX Fabrications to keep it secret. Hit their admin center on Bellsize Way and search the main terminal. I text you code names you're looking for. Any special requests? We got the whole hour, baby. It's time for smooth talker. What if he what if he sounded that calm as he was yelling at me like this? Look, I don't judge assets by how well they blither into their phones. Raichu Doggy just subscribed. Thank you, Raichu. I love ya. Thank you so much for subscribing to the Bear Taffy Smooth Talking Jazz session. Thanks for the tip, Gandhi. Thanks for the tip. Raichu Doggy Bear Hug. You are the greatest man that ever did live. I gotta clear my voice. There is delicious. Mmm, yeah. Where am I? Oh, I'm over on the far left. There we go. Oh, thank you, Raichu. I love you. Glad you're enjoying yourself here tonight. Now we got a switch. Ooh, this looks fun. Ha ha! <laughs> oh, that's great. What can we do with this? This is gonna be a good time. He is looking right at what we need. Or rather, looking right behind it, actually. But if I use that elevator... It's gonna trigger him. Hmm. I need to get down here too. There's a whole system of things I need. Can I trigger this switch to go right there? It doesn't look like it. Where does the security camera go? Maybe that'll trigger this trap door. No? Hmm. Must be a couple of different options here. Go ahead and get him to start looking this way. That might be for the best. And then go right back down. Can run over here. Can remap the light switch to something. Although it might currently be in my best interest to, uh... Oh, hang on. Whoops. Can we reach this all the way up here? Hey, that's an option. Oh! Ha! <laughs> that didn't work. Let's try this again. If I'm quick enough, I might be able to make this work, although I could just take him out. Well, I'm gonna take him out anyway. Why, why not? Whoa! Oh, he's armed! <laughs> well, that's the difference maker. Oh, damn. Alright, let's try this one more time here. Clearly, I don't have the options I thought I did. Alright, now he's wandering around. This is giving me the opportunity to, uh... Trigger the power surge here. Got him! Oh, that's awesome. That is super badass. For God's sake, Fritz, how many times we are not making anything for Rook? We would, she's great, but she hasn't asked us to, so please stop sending people to steal it. The first guy got knocked out by a prank spasm light switch, but the last two we had to kill. My company invents shit that hurts people in weird ways. That's a great slogan. Now let's get down to the basement. Ah, here's our wire jack, which is enabling us now to hopefully be able to access this area. What can we switch around here? Obviously, we want to try to open that up. If we go like this... Oh, I have an idea. I'm going to make that turn that off, and we're also going to attach this to here so we can walk by the camera and trigger that trap door. Right? Totally. That worked. Excellent. Use the light switch to open up the doorway, and there we go! Bear's voice is like sweet, hot melt. <laughs> we've, we've been over this, man. That sounds dangerous and disgusting, but I appreciate the sentiment. Uh, now, how do we get back up? I suppose we just need to rewire this thing here, right? 
There we go. Yep. Excellent. Oh my goodness, I just realized now we can climb on most of these ceilings. That's so freaking cool! Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, we need to open this doorway first of all. Uh, go like that. There we go. Beautiful. Another A+. Plus. Got a super ghost. Anyone who might have seen you, including anyone who pounced on but didn't kill. I am truly Spider-Man. Well, we were we were just discussing what's his bucket. What is his actual name? That's just <laughs> that's gonna drive me crazy now. I can't remember the name of Peter Parker's boss in Spider-Man. Oh boy, did you get it? Prototypes of the TB TX fabrication facility on Lyle. Need to hear from me when we're ready to move. Damn, that went pretty well, right? Spooter Bear. Is his name... Oh, J. Jonah Jameson. That's what it is. The JJJ. Mm-hmm. There's something you should know about your Intex contract. So, how did you know about that, Rook? Mm. Yeah, I gulped audibly. Out of fear. Oh, boy. What are my options here? I can get a prank spasm to booby trap electronics. That sounds like fun. I've basically just been killing everyone. <laughs> I haven't really had a problem with it. I think I'm gonna go with Katie real quick here to avoid the, uh, the conflict between Redhead and J. Jonah Jameson. The JJJ. That's his name from now on. It's no longer Fritz. I'd really like to know what's on that recording. I don't want to get Jackson arrested or anything, but if the recording proves to hey, frame me, I, I really, I really need to get out of here. I really, really need it. Super bad. You have no idea. Told me once that Intex base, all their dirty ops out of their office on Marlow Street. If you can get... <laughs> oh, that's my favorite thing, is just to end words abruptly. That's California girl. Hack a thing, got it. There we go. We're at Intex headquarters. There's a guard right here. Ooh boy. Well, we have an option here of just grabbing onto this. Walk right on by. Suck it. Ooh, better plan. Let's do this. I'm gonna rewire this switch to close this door. He's not gonna notice a damn thing. I'm gonna drop right down in his face. Suck it. Suck it, suck it. Suck it, he suck, suck, suck it. Wire jack. Then we got another guard up here guarding this very totem pole I need to access. Accessorize. I'm typing this with one hand, if you know what I mean. <laughs> For the California girl, I don't know if I'm comfortable with that. Uh, now we got a closed door here. I should be able to just go up here and, uh... Oh, you know what? Actually, I think I need to rewire this light switch to open up this doorway, which shouldn't be that big of a deal. There we go. Access the terminal like so. Don't get me wrong, I'm excited about this job. Very grateful, but I'm uh, really struggling to see how this company strategy makes any sense at all. East Point has been a hot spot in the past. They wanted to open a branch here for a long time, but that was before the ban. East Point was built on guns, mostly by Rook. Why can't we just back out and wait for them to die? That would be a red-haired lady's husband, huh? Huh? The little suction to go. Oh, dude, I like that too. It's perfect. So subtle. So beautiful. God, this soundtrack is really my favorite thing right now. Let's see. And turn off his light, which pretty much seems like my only option at this point, so I'll go ahead and do that. He's gonna stay in there as long as I don't open the doorway. But he's just gonna turn off the light switch, which means all I have to do is resync this to something else. So he's gonna go like that, open up the doorway for me. Excellent. Can no longer see me, which is to my advantage, clearly. Wire jack. Reset this switch to go here. Oh, uh oh, hang on a bit. 
But if I did that, that would probably be to my benefit. It locks him out of this area. Ooh, and I can lock him in that room? Oh, that's fun. Oh, wait, I can't do that. It has to be from downstairs. Okay, well, I gotta just resync this anyway, so let's go ahead and do this. Oh, hold up a second. This is a curious situation, isn't it? Hmm. Lock him in the red door room. Yeah, I wanted to. Looks like the security camera is the only thing that we can tie to this. So we're gonna have to get back outside. Obviously. Let's go ahead and go downstairs. Not really a lot of risk associated with that. And, uh... Can we even open this up? Looks like we'll have to go all the way over the building. Not that big of a deal. I'm gonna go like so. Big ass jump. And there we go. Alright. Back the way whence we came. I like it. I like it. This is my first time playing. Yeah, totally blind here. I have not done this game, seen this game, done anything at all to ruin the experience, so I am stoked. Go ahead and hack that up. Main objective complete. Super badass! That went pretty damn well, I'd say. Not too many problems. I am... I am THE frog. I am a bear frog. And let's get out. Oh, whoops. Well, that'll do anyway. Excellent! Ghostly enough, I'd say. Went pretty damn well. Let's see how much money we got. Maybe we can afford an upgrade. Did you find it? Whoops. Oh, God, I ended the call prematurely. Oh, I know what that's like. Ha! <laughs> oh, well. That was bound to happen at some point. There's the Biss Frog, yes. Totally, literally wearing a blindfold, exactly. All right, guys, that'll do it for the first hour here for Gunpoint. Gotta love this music. I, threw, I hung the right the hell up on her, man. That was rude. Hello, Foxile. Yeah, that'll do it here for Gunpoint for the first hour. Thanks so much for watching. If you're watching this on YouTube, thanks so much for watching over there as well. That was an hour, I know. Time certainly does fly. We got some Spelunky to play, though, here tonight on the Bear Taffy Live Show. Thanks for following the stream. Thanks for coming out. Very much appreciate it. Thank you so much for subscribing today, guys, if you did choose to do so. Throwing on some Spelunky again. Thanks so much for watching the first hour at Gunpoint. Playing this for a couple more shows, at least. So follow if you're interested. Subscribe if you like what you see, if you're watching on YouTube. And thanks for watching. My name's Bear. I'll see you in just a bit.